my dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus today is december 1st we commemorate the feast of saint eligius the bishop of noyon saint eligius born around 588 ad originally from limons the good saint eligius belonged to a wealthy ruler family who worked their own land unlike many land owners who left the cultivation to slaves he left the care of the family farm to one of his brothers and entered trade as a goldsmith apprentice in a shop in which the royal coin was hammered according to ancient roman methods he saved some of the income from his family and gave it to the charity to the poor and slaves he was as clever as animal in goldsmithing these professional qualities went hand in hand with a selfless honesty when they asked him to make the golden throne for king call the second he made a second with the extra he did not want to hold himself this gesture extraordinary at the time earned him the trust of the king who asked him to reside in paris as a royal goldsmith a royal court officer and court counselor named coin master in mercelis he would redeem many of the slaves sold at the port when dagot became king in 1629 he was summoned to paris where he directed the shops of the frankish kingdom in which coin was minted among others he had the task of embellishing the tombs of saint genevi and saint denis he made reliquaries for saint german saint servanus saint martin and saint columbia and numerous liturgical objects for the new abbey of saint denis thanks to his honesty his frankness and his capacity for peaceable judgment he came so far into the king's trust who often called him to himself great was the piety and prayer life of this layman who often attended monastic offices in 1632 he founded the sloganic monastery south of imonges while Eligius still lived the monastery had grown to count more than 150 monks under the two rules of saint benedict and saint columbian the monastery was under the protection of the king and not under the authority of the bishop the religious fervor and the order placed in its work made it one of the most prosperous monasteries of the time one year after the foundation of sloganic monastery he founded the first monastic house for women religious in paris whose direction he entrusted to saint arure a year after the death of dagbert whom he had seen in the last moments of his life eligius left the court together with saint adonis who had served a counselor and chancellor under dagbert like adonis eligius also enters formation and is ordained priest on the same day may 13 1641 they received the episcopate saint adonis the see of rouen eligius is made bishop of noyon and torrenay eligius put all his zeal into apostolic mission he died in 1660 on the eve of his departure for chaos holy queen bethelda traveled to greet him but he would come too late in paris a church was dedicated to him in the quarter of the blacksmiths locksmiths and cabinet makers the church of saint eligius rebuilt in 1967 a church destroyed in 1793 was dedicated to him in the rue der orfes near the hotel de la monia in notre dame cathedral in the chapel of saint anne one home to jewelers and goldsmiths co fraternity the jewelers and goldsmiths of paris have placed his statue and restored his altar my dear brothers saint religious is a man who is kind hearted as we commemorate his feast today let us ask the intercession of saint eligius that we may be also kind to the people who are in need amen